I'm Cal the Pirate. I'm a singer-songwriter from Montreal, and I compose the music for Child of Light. Cal the Pirate brings that sense of intimacy. There's also a youthfulness in the music in the way she plays the piano. My experience with Ubisoft was great. I was there from the beginning, so I remember when they asked me to do it, they didn't have like that much material for me to work with, so I got to have this complete freedom. And then when I first saw the, the, the images, I was thrown away. I thought it was wonderful. Uh, it was so beautifully made. There's so much depth to it all, and I really felt that I could uh, work with that. For me, the music was there to create that sense of intimacy, of nostalgia when we're exploring, but also that sense of energy uh, that we have when we're doing fights or bus fights. At first it was supposed to be something really small, just like a piano and guitar and maybe a cello, and it was kind of a challenge because whenever you get into a boss fight, it gets so much more intense. <laughs> and we actually had to commission a whole orchestra to do the boss fights. It's really epic, big, and operatic. I remember seeing for the first time the music on the images and I kind of teared up a little bit because <laughs> it's just so wonderful to, to see something come to life like that. I wanted the sound to be really organic and magical at the same time, so it was, it was quite of a challenge to get those two mixed together. For our hours, I, I didn't want uh, the Foley just to be the only thing that would make the sound, uh, you know, just cloth and, and gear. So for the wings, we tried so many things. It was never working, really. At the end, Chai, the Foley artist, uh, suggested we use a flower. And it actually works really good. It makes some really believable wings loops. We also work with Cirque du Soleil to really help enhance the sense of theatricality in our game. My first impression of this project was, wow, this looks wonderful, it's beautifully designed. I think it's a breath of fresh air in a world where most video games are based on, on muscular demonstrations of graphics and power. Working with Cirque du Soleil brings us their world-class experience in realization and also in terms of design, they're used to create those extravagant costumes, those exotic world. And for me, that was a perfect match with Child of Light. They would show me things, they would ask for my opinion, and we would just debate and discuss uh, how some of these things could be um, improved or transformed. I'm not a video game designer, and I think that's what they specifically wanted from me, was the stage direction point of view. I was sort of brought back to my childhood into this sort of fairy tale uh, world that was very beautiful and very fulfilling and to be able to play something that reminds me of these fairy tales was truly great. The writing in Child of Light is entirely in rhyme and so I had to really um, treat almost every stanza as a puzzle. <laughs> 